Welcome to a lesson on converting between mixed numbers and improper fractions on the TI-84 or TI-83 graphing calculator. Now the methods in this video are not shown to replace basic skills with fractions. However, it does give you the opportunity to check your own work or focus on problem solving. Let's start by taking a look at converting a mixed number to an improper fraction. So the first example is four and five sevenths. Well first, the graphing calculator does not have a specific fraction key or a special way of entering in mixed numbers. However, we can think of this as four plus five sevenths. So if we enter in four plus five divided by seven, again we use division for the fraction bar, and now if we press enter, it'll give us a decimal approximation, but if we press the math key, and then notice fraction is already highlighted, so we just need to press enter and then enter. It'll convert this decimal into an improper fraction. So four and five sevenths is equal to 33 sevenths. Looking at the next example, we have negative 12 and three fifths. Well, we know our mixed number is going to be negative. So we're gonna enter into the calculator 12 plus three fifths, and then of course the result will be negative. So 12 and 3 fifths would be entered in as 12 plus 3 fifths. And 3 divided by 5 is how we enter in 3 fifths. Press enter. The calculator automatically gives the decimal value. And then to convert this to an improper fraction, we just press math, enter, enter. And so it's equal to negative 63 fifths. Now let's take a look at converting improper fractions to mixed numbers. And the main thing to remember here is this fraction bar represents division. So to convert 82 six to a mixed number, we can go to the calculator and enter in 82 divided by six, press enter, and again it gives us the decimal value for this, but we want the mixed number. So there's a couple things to recognize. First, we should recognize that the whole number of the mixed number is going to be 13, so our major concern is what does point six repeating represent as a fraction? So let's go ahead and subtract the 13, leaving just the decimal. And now with just the decimal, we can press math, enter, enter, and it will convert the decimal to a fraction. So 82 six is the same as 13 and two thirds. And then for the next one, negative 121 ninths. Again, we're gonna go ahead and put down the negative sign, and then we'll convert 121 over nine into a mixed number. So we'll enter 121 divided by nine. We're gonna press enter. Again, notice the whole number of the mixed number is 13. So let's go ahead and subtract the 13 from this value, leaving just the decimal part and then we'll convert the decimal part to a fraction. So we press math, enter, enter, and so negative 121 ninths is the same as negative 13 and four ninths. So I hope you can now use the graphing calculator to check your conversions from improper fractions to mixed numbers and from mixed numbers to improper fractions. Thank you for watching.